summer 2019 is coming to an end. Fall 2019 is about to begin. And for today's Henry Short, I'm going to react to another awesome channel video. It is called the 100th Video Special. So without further ado, let's get started. 3, 2, 1, play. Okay, this is actually the intro of Awesome Channel. And whoa, now there is something you don't see every day. Wow, a lot of clips. And there is a mystery mark on the white spot. Ugh. That is the most ugliest cat I ever saw in my life. What has become of this channel? Well, I don't know, Eric Cartman. No, no, Seems like you're missing a cat. And looks like you're, you're gonna have to go, pretty much go back in time in order to find this cat of yours. More like you need to find this hideous cat of yours, because he seems ugly. <laughs> What, Mrs. Butters or Mr. Butters? But well, never mind all that. Don't worry. Super Cartman's here. Save the day. Let's now the are torn apart by political differences. We are two sides at war. Two likes and six dislikes? That is so unreal. I don't know what kind of people would say would not like any of Awesome Channel's videos. He seems he seems awesome. That's why he's called Awesome Channel, because he's an awesome dude. Get it? Oh boy, oh boy. Wow. Now that's epic, don't you think? Okay, now that's a little rude. I'm trying to tell your mom to shut up. She just said the word hi, Cartman. Can you just say hi to him back? I mean, Dominic Idea's mother says says hi to her when she says hi to him. The 100th video special. Okay, so Eric Cartman traveled all the way back in time. And speaking of which, awesome channel, have you ever heard of the musical called The Book of Mormon? It's kind of like South Park, but unlike South Park, it's a little bit of a bit of a storyline. Oh, Mrs. Tweety, the main villain of Chicken Run. Just so you know, Dominic I Danza or Ashley I Danza or any of the I Danza people never brought Mrs. Tweety to life as the I Danza villain just yet. But one day, if they ever, if one of them proves Chicken Run on stage, maybe she will be the next I Danza villain. And Mr. Tweety, the dim-witted nigga poop. And there's Ginger. Just see no us Oh, whoa. Ah, oh, Jesus. Oh, okay. You're one angry chicken. Speaking of chicken run, awesome channel. Um, have you ever heard of the musical called Turkeys Go on Strike? Because it's kind of like Chicken Run, but unlike Chicken Run, turkeys go. The turkeys usually, um, you know, go after the humans rather than escape from villains. I don't want to spoil it on you because you know, like, um, you'll know. You know, once you get to see it one day, once you get to know it, the storyline one day. And we're somewhere in outer space. Uh, uh, what kind? It sounds like a like a, the spaceship is kind of farting or something. And we're here in the ocean or there on the sea, and we see this creepy old man trying to call for help. Let me just tell you something, Mike. He kind of looks like a, a flipping zombie. Um, hello? What's happening? That is not a lighthouse, old man. Anyway, that is the Iron Giant. Oh, oh my god! What the heck is this ugly dude? I'm gonna say this. those two well, people are just it, alike. Michael, because I I really that, that, okay, that English man seems really weird and looks really, really ugly and disgusting. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Mike, I'm just having, having fun with you. No offense. Okay. And this old man's okay. I think he's okay. Okay, and and he finally reached the lighthouse. Congratulations, creepy old man. Oh, and here's Hogarth, a young boy and a young hero of this movie. And also the hero that no one has ever brought to the eyes of the stages yet. And of course, speaking of Iron John the movie, I mean... I think it's been many years since Dominic Guy Danza and a few other trains from Sodor, including me, seen the Iron Giant in Sodor cinemas. And of course, if there's going to be a stage adaption of the Iron Giant, maybe Dominic Guy Danza or Ashley or Brittany or Morgan or other people would try to audition for it too. Oh boy. I wouldn't touch that if I were you. I wouldn't. Oh Jesus! Whoa! Oh my god! Whoa! 
Yeah, and that could be painful. Yeah. Hello, you're talking to someone? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, just so you know, I know what James is going to do. I know he's going to touch things that are very dangerous. I wouldn't want to touch it because, first of all, I would get myself exploded. And second of all, I would definitely get myself, you know, dirty. Because, you know, like, I don't want to get myself dirty because of rain or something that can touch me. Because I don't want my paint to get ruined. You know, my green paint. Yeah, Hogarth. Turn off the off switch. Come on. Turn off the off switch. Come on. Turn it off. Turn it off. Come on, Hercules. Come on. Come on. And finally, I'm pretty sure the electricity is out dude, thanks to the Iron Man and Hogarth. And he's pretty much dead. And here's this detective guy. I can't remember his name anymore. And he's the main villain of the Iron Giant. And yeah, one day this guy will be the upcoming Aya Danza villain. Once Dominic or any other Aya Danza member would bring Iron Giant to life to, this, to the stage version. And there is a shark robot. What is this guy complaining about? And this detective... Actually, it is not delicious. It is disgusting. Okay, now that is pretty much the weirdest duck ever. That freaks me out a little bit. <laughs> Hog. Yeah, never heard of that one. It kind of sounds a little bit like Hogwarts. A little bit. Whoa, whoa. What are you, a frog or something, robot man? Whoa! <laughs> Oh, I remember Percy saying that. that right Guys, better watch out for the train, because there's a train coming. You better look at it. Yeah, put it back. Put that back where it belongs. Put that back. Come on, let's go. Careful. Go, go. Stop. Careful. Careful. Yeah, careful. Hurry up. No, 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 no. Ooh. Oh, 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 oh. <coughs> oh, my God. Jesus, I'm scared of the moving binoculars out of me. Yeah. Oh, no. Actually, it's all your fault, Hogarth. Hey, maybe it's not his fault after all. He's alive, but maybe his jaw is broken. <laughs> okay. What is this Iron Man doing? Okay. And is, is this? Are those supposed to be his parts? That's part of his body that's going going towards him. You know, to help him put him back together or something. Okay. Okay. Yeah, change your mind, change your plan. Puts himself together. Let's see how SpongeBob's party is shaping up. It's still Mrs. Tweety and Mr. Tweety. That's not Patrick, you moron. Pies come out. Ooh. Ooh. Chicken pies. I have no idea. So I think it's probably your fault, Mrs. Tweety. You're the one that wanted him to marry him, or maybe Mr. Mr. Tweety actually asked you to marry him, because you know, like you've been dating for like so long, or few years or whatever it is I know I remember this robotic dinosaur before okay we travel all the way back in time oh what is going on here what are you doing to the robot dinosaur this time wait stop calling everyone idiots Mrs. Tweety I think each and every one of you characters are nothing but idiots <laughs> and we travel back in time and whoa whoa okay okay Okay, so this is the 100th video special of Awesome Channel. Awesome Channel, what is really the story about your 100th video special? I'll tell ya, it's fantastic! I mean, you should all subscribe to Awesome Channel immediately because he did such a great work. And that would wrap up for today's Henry Short, so don't you guys forget to be our guest subscribe to Awesome Channel, Andrew Brooking, People Blast 556677, and of course, Awesome Channel, and I will see you guys later for the next Henry Short. Bye.